video and normally we do our unboxing videos all together but we got this box and we wanted to share it with you before we did our one at the end of the month because we're still waiting for other ones to come yeah. in yeah yeah this one's a little different than our normal like kind of geek theme ones and such uh this one's a little bit more uh the parents of you would probably be interested in and this one's called surprise ride and it's a cool box uh created by these two sisters and um they were on shark tank at one point pitching this uh, to the sharks there to try to get it promoted. It didn't get through, but it is actually doing very well on its own. They did it on their own with this. And uh, what Surprise Ride is, uh, before I get into the box to show you what's all in it, it's basically a box that's supposed to inspire children to kind of get up and go outside and use their creativity. Uh, you get an activity in there that, or a couple of, act two activities that actually uh, helps you create something. Uh, you'll get uh, a snack, and then you'll also get some other little goodies in there to kind of, again, inspire and educate kids. And I really love that theme. I'm all about mm. education and things like that. So I thought this was a cool box to try out. Uh, below we'll have a, a link where you can actually get your first box free. You just pay for shipping. Mm. So, so yeah. that, that's an affiliate link that you'll yes. Okay, okay. Yeah, so uh, you'll get your first box free. So uh, you get to try it out and see if it's really something your kids <laughs> are going to love. Um, so yeah, we'll go ahead and look in this box. Tissue paper. So yes, Woo. very exciting so far. <laughs> but yeah, I've, I've always thought, you know, uh, boxes like this for like kids is a really cool idea. I mean, you have so many for adults. What kid wouldn't love getting a surprise like this? Plus, most know. kids just love, like, I don't know, a lot of the unboxings that I watch, especially if they're moms or dads that that do these videos, they're mm -hmm. always like, my kid loves it when I get this, like, thing in the mail mm -hmm. every month that's like, they don't know what it's in it. So yeah. this one is actually targeting kids. I'm sure they're yes. that much more... Excited oh yeah it. yeah it's gonna have like their name on it and everything uh so this month uh this box is themed to birds birdsville has cute little birds there on the front and so yeah that's uh, each month has some kind of theme to it um in this little uh booklet here it tells you all about birds and things like that some surprise facts uh so some really neat things like hummingbirds can fly backwards imagine yourself walking backwards to school <laughs> so yeah, uh, <laughs> some really fun little uh, things in there. Mm -hmm. um, and then that card. This is the guide, so it has what is in the box. Oh, cool. And then on the back, it has all of their social media information. You can hashtag surprise ride with pictures of whatever it is your kid has made with what's in the box. So yeah. I think that's pretty cool too. Um, you can find them at surprise ride on Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, Pinterest, and then they have their own website as well. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so I can read the card right. though while you go cool. through them. <laughs> All right, so the first thing I'll uh, show in here is they also come with a book each month too. And this month there's a book called Blackie the Crow. So, so this, yeah. This is a classic bird tale by one of the most loved authors in American history, who is Thornton Burgess. Oh, I've actually Thornton heard Burgess. of him, yeah. Okay, and so this is perfect for reading out loud. Yay! Yeah, and it's actually a pretty decent book, especially if you love reading to your kids at night, like a bedtime story kind of thing. It's got a bit to it. It's not some little short couple-page book. So pretty much, uh, I'd say any kid like under 12 is probably going to have a lot of fun with that mm -hmm. if they love reading. Mm -hmm. And if they don't, perfect start. <laughs> All right, so the next thing in here we have, okay, so you get two activities. Um, the first activity I'll show is this one. Okay. So, yeah. Actually, this one has three activities, oh. if you can count that. Okay. This is a cool. bird glider. So this is assemble this fun toy and see how far you can fly. Yeah. I remember these when I was growing up, honestly. I yeah. thought they were great. Like, mine didn't look like bird. It was an actual airplane, but I yeah. remember this. Yeah, I don't think I've ever seen a bird one before. But, yeah, this one has all kinds of different birds. This one in particular is a seagull, which in Florida... I'm not a big fan of, but... No. I do <laughs> remember cool. when my grandparents, uh, for like my entire life, pretty much, uh, they lived in, they come from Porterville, but they moved to Morro Bay, and I remember mm. loving it because their house was up on the hill, 
of, like, you could see Morro Rock. I don't know if you're familiar mm -hmm. with this, but it's south of San Luis Obispo. Mm -hmm. So um, when you're up on the hill of their house, you could go on their back porch and see Morro Rock with the ocean coming in. Mm -hmm. And so all, it was just a very, like, five to ten minute drive down to where the beach was. Yeah. And we would take a loaf of bread and feed the seagulls, and, uh, like, they would just swarm you. Uh, and as a kid, I loved that. But, uh, yeah. you know, as an adult, <laughs> I am not fond of Most that. <laughs> 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 um, all right, so then one of the other things in here is, woo, show that up there. Oh, so this is a bird whistle. Yeah. Can you get a bird to chirp along, it says, so yeah. you can take it outside and like, there you go. Good thing my cat's not know. in here. He'd probably be going crazy. Oh, that's true. oh yeah. <laughs> that's cool. I mean, uh, so you got a bird whistle. Uh -huh. All right, and then the snack that you get in this one is seed and fruit, seed not and nuts. Fruit. It says not nuts, seed and fruit. Yeah. Okay. Wait, but there's actually nuts. They are nut free for so if your kid is you know any nut allergies, no, uh, but yeah. Gluten free, dairy free, and nut free. So what is it that's actually in there? This has, this is called Beach Bash, it has sunflower kernels, pineapple, pumpkin seeds, cranberries, and apricots. Interesting. Ooh, that when I first good. saw this, I was like, I don't, I don't know. No, because I'm, yeah. I only like some nuts. Um, but now that you say what it is, it actually sounds interesting. Yeah, and I love sunflower seeds. And if you don't like it, you can mm. feed it to birds because Yes, seeds. yeah, that's the, you know, the theme of the thing. Mm -hmm. so, mm -hmm. There it is. That's cool. Nice little healthy snack. Mm -hmm. All right, so the activities, the big ones that come in here that the kids get to do. Uh, the first one is the... Uh, seed balls? Yes. Make and launch seed balls. So basically you get soil and clay mix seeds... Dibber, a plant marker, and a tray. So yeah, there's a yellow tray in here in the bottom of the box, which I have stuff on top of it, so I can't really take it out. But uh, yeah, there's stuff in here to make little seed balls, so you can plant some flowers to attract some birds. So that's neat. We should go to Home Depot and get like a little pot. Ooh, and that way yeah. we can put it outside our door. That's cool. And then you got the card here that tells you how to do it. How to, oh, this side. How to make the, how to launch seed balls. So yeah, that's neat. I always love making like things like that in school. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And then I don't know. I tend to kill plants really badly. <laughs> um, but it was funny because yesterday we went to this candle shop. Uh, Corey and I did, and the guy was talking about plants, and he's like, "Well, you need to like talk to them. You know how you hear that thing about oh, the yeah, music, yeah. and yeah. you play the music, and they're healthy. But they've done you know studies where if you talk to the plant, they'll actually be healthier. So maybe that's my problem is I'm not talking not to the plants talking. enough." Um, maybe we'll try it with that. <laughs> Cause I plant. Love you. <laughs> uh, and then uh, we've got that painting a birdhouse. Yes. This is actually really cool. Yeah, I'm kind of excited to do that. Now, what's interesting about this is you get a birdhouse, paint, paintbrush, feathers, glue, a water dish, and an apron. Yes. That is they all they in sent you an actual apron. Do you yes. want to show what the tray looks like? All right. Okay, so, so basically it comes with a paper plate that they're calling it a tray, but it's it's like a um, paper plate. I don't know what is this this coating. I can't remember. Like, oh yeah, you know, it's not like your basic paper plate. It's got that like almost plastic yeah, coating on the top of it. Um, but you can probably find this like at any Dollar Tree if you run out or need it for other projects. But yeah, that's cool that they have that for you to use as well. All right, is here we go. Apron? Okay, the apron is plastic. Disposable. It's mm -hmm. polyethylene. Yeah, it's plastic-ish. <laughs> it's basically like those bibs you get when you go to, um, maybe a little oh, lighter. Sure that's right. A little lighter than those bibs that when you go to like a lobster restaurant or something and you yeah. get a bib. Yeah, that's what, mm. I'm gonna paint a birdhouse. <laughs> Definitely Ooh. child size. Yes, for children. <laughs> Not for adults. <laughs> yeah. So you got that, and then you got all kinds of like cool feathers Ooh. to kind of decorate. They have on the there. legit glue. They have Aline's tacky yes. glue. That's legit glue. Yeah. Hello. And then uh, you got some paints, which these look like good quality paints too. Mm -hmm. Not just like some, you know, like a tray of the weird uh, yeah. watercolor, and you then your, your dish. water dish. So you can clean off your brush. Honestly, like, okay, yeah. so how much did how much did this cost? Um. It was, well, because I just paid for shipping for my first box, it was $6, basically. Uh, normally, I believe it's 24 
twenty four ninety five I think for I the think whole I'm box, so, and like, that includes just, your shipping. Just the, the supplies for this is at least twenty four dollars if you were yeah. going to like purchase it at Michaels or Joanne's mm -hmm. or something. Like I think that's totally yeah. worth it. Yeah, I mean, there's definitely going to be a few hours of play time with this and doing stuff, and you know, mm -hmm. I mean, it's definitely worth it. Uh, I think to get you know a fun surprise. Mm -hmm. You know, you never know what it's going to be about. Uh, so yeah. I would have yeah. to say that this, this is a great box and you know, we don't have kids, um, in our house, so we, we don't really have like time to do that with the children, but even for like me as an adult, I would totally do this, yeah, you know, like the birdhouse and the, and, and the plant, I would do it. Um, mm -hmm. so I think it's not just for kids. If you're like into crafty stuff, this might be for you too. Yeah. And I would love to review another box. I mean. <laughs> Maybe we can contact them and be like, hey, we'll do another one for you. Because I, mean, I like it. What do you think? Yeah, yeah, it's really cool. I would love this as a kid. Um, I mean, I like it as an adult, but as a kid, I'd be so thrilled to get something like this. I loved getting those, like, those zoo books in the mail. Oh, yeah. If you remember those, I loved those. So, like, this is kind of, like, around that alley of, like, getting, like, a fun surprise each month that's, you know, uh -huh. educational and fun. Exactly. Look down below for all the ordering information as well as maybe a code or something that you can use for another yeah. purchase. Maybe yeah, definitely check it out. You know. Yeah. Um, thank you so much for watching. And if you like this kind of thing, make sure you comment down below um, and let us know. Yeah. So thank all you so right. much for watching. And until next time, keep calm. Stay zany.